We are live for the showdown. We've got Ego versus Steel. We've got our two competitors here. Derek, give me a wave. Versus Vaden. Vaden, you got the Steel battery powered push mower. Derek's got the Ego battery powered push mower here. So, we've got these guys here that are going to uh, commentate and tell you guys about it. This is Preston. He is our uh, step in when either one of these two get tired. Preston is our tag team. He'll step in and take over the mowers. We got Chad Kiefer. You want to get a picture of the blades underneath? Flip them on up. So we've got Ego Blades versus the Steel Single Blade. We got Chad, Cody, and Dana here as our commentators for this live event. So, all right, boys. Ready to start, Preston? Tell them ready, set, go. Uh oh, technical difficulties here with the steel. Laden with the steel. Derek with the uh, ego. And we got the commentators right here that'll chime in at any point. It looks like that one there might be, we need the, the depth. Do they look the same? They're both kind of three inches. Okay. Down there's where it looks the best, you know, that grass down there is kind of nice. That's that good old heavy duty grass. The camera. <laughs> You'll notice the different sizes in bags as well. You'll be making more stops with the steel than you would with the Ego. We'll go through this same grass right here that Steel was having trouble with. Ego didn't really have an issue there, so go through. We had a little rain last night. Cody's going to have him take a little bit longer passes here. Go ahead and go down there to the, towards the center there, Derek. Keep going this way.
We got this guy here for the showdown. Derek, come on up here so you guys aren't by, right beside each other. Both still running strong. The steel and the ego, both still running strong there. Oh. Maiden's gonna have to stop a little bit there. Steel's getting choked up. They're both doing a nice quality of cut there, the ego and the steel. Got our crazy man going, like I say. We've got uh, out here on the highway. We want to make sure everybody can stop and see the showdown here. Dana, what do you think? Tell me a little bit about these mowers. Tell me about that ego mower. Ego, ego mower. That's going to be more of their flagship model. It's a 10 aught battery. Um, has, I believe, 90. They're saying about 90 minutes runtime. Um, and one of their one of their nicer ones, um, pretty comparable to the steel that we're running against it though. Ego batteries are all interchangeable, so that battery on that Ego works on the string trimmers, works on the blowers, works on each one of them. I think the steel is losing power. Already. I think the uh, the steel battery is different for I believe the string trimmer than the battery that they use for the mower. Oh, we got a full bag there. Vaden's got a full bag, so he's gonna bring that down here. And so Derek, why don't you dump your bag as well? Let's see how much grass you got. Yep, your bag's full as well. We've got a lot of damp, thick grass down here. So Vaden's gonna dump his grass over there on that side. There's the steel. And here's the ego. Mowed for the same amount of time, and I think you can tell there that the Ego actually has more grass there. The bagger is bigger if they hold the bags together. Bring him right down here, boys. So, if you see those two bags side by side, you can tell that that Ego batter, bagger is a little bit bigger. It's actually about an inch longer, too, so... All right, guys, go back to mowing. Keep see if see how long those batteries last. The ego pops the grass a lot better compared to the longer steel. Big chunk still left with the steel. But this is this is all pretty small. Alright, we got them back out here mowing again. We're out here on the highway, plus the crazy man. Cody, we actually have a request for you to do the crazy man dance. <laughs> what? What's the crazy man dance? <laughs> we'll shut the crazy man off and just let Cody dance for a minute. How's he dance? <laughs> <laughs> What do they think? Is that about the same? That's all I'm doing. That's all you're getting from me. <laughs> you gotta pay for more. 
So we got Cody doing the crazy man dance. We got these two guys out here mowing. So the Ego battery, like I say, goes over to a number of different products. The uh, string trimmer, the blower, the multi-tool. Multi head tool, pull saw attachment, add your, so what, anything you can think of. What's the multi-tool? Multi-tool is like a, uh, kind of looks like your string trimmer, but it's a multi-head where you can put an edger on it, a pull saw blade, uh, bristle broom, yeah, bristle, br uh, bristle brush, power broom, rubber paddle broom, about anything you can think of what you need my for your lawn and ego, garden. My favorite Ego product is the gutter cleaner from the 650 blower. You can stand on the ground, reach right up top, blow all your leaves out, and you're done. Do it two or three times a year, have the cleanest gutters in town. That's right. You heard it from right there, Chad Keeper. That steel's struggling, fellas. Oh, I got called a week. The ego caught up there with the uh, with the steel. Derek's having to wait for Vaden because that uh, steel's having a little more trouble. What are what are we? Uh, 12, 12 minutes in ish. Um, when they stopped to unload bags, the steel was already halfway through a battery. The ego hasn't shown any sign of losing any power yet. Ego powered right through that thick grass down here. This was the pass right here with the, the steel. And Vaden had to stop several times to let it uh, catch back up. And then this right through that thick... I mean, we had... We had rain last night, so this grass is a little bit damp. Um, there's some moisture in this grass here. Uh, we're down here in the road ditch, so it is a little bit thicker, heavier, um, taller grass. So it's it's probably more than what you'd be mowing in your... There we are. Sorry about that. We lost connection down here. Uh, but we... Uh, this is heavier grass than what uh, typically would be mowed in somebody's lawn. And so this grass here is pretty thick. So Vaden's having some trouble again. Derek's going ahead and down there and he's just mowing away. Give it the old lawnmower shake. Maybe you got grass underneath that whole thing. Bang, bang, bang. Bang. That's a little bit. What happened there, guys? I was down on the other end. Tell me. We had him he had up her around. clogged up, and he had to give her the old uh, push mower shake. Freed her up, left those clumps out there. It's, he's having, he's struggling with, he's about out of power. Yeah, he's down to one bar. And he does not look happy about it either. If he was old enough, he'd have a beverage in his hand. Look at the grass time. hanging out from underneath that thing. <laughs> to all you dads out there, it's about the time where you throw it out in the highway. Vaden, what do you think? Not good. <laughs>
Hmm. Yeah, that steel's pretty much full, that bag is again. So let's go dump those bags again. Derek, go ahead and dump that bag again and then go over there and mow right where Vaden was mowing. Yeah, there isn't a whole lot in there. All right, go ahead and go over. Let's go right over there where that steel was having trouble and see what this ego does. Well, good news is, is we got the professional over there with the steel now. <laughs> See if he can get it going. The steel's all clogged up. That ego, right where the steel clogged up here. Went right on through it and uh, actually picked up some of the clogged grass clippings I think Chad threw out from the steel. All right, Vaden, let's try it right there, next, that next pass right there where, where Derek just went with the ego. See, see if that steel can handle this. Just start right there. Oh, we got a meeting here. Let's see if they can pass each other. These boys are doing pretty good. What have we went? 20 minutes? Are we at 20 minutes? Yep. 18. 18 minutes. Vaden and Derek both upright still. Uh, any football coaches that are out there watching, make sure you notice these two boys out here doing this work. Preston, you, you as well, right? Mm -hmm. You're supervising these two. You're in charge. So we uh, still got the ego in the steel, both, both still running here. Both boys still upright. Derek's going to come down here and get this strip that we left out in the middle. We should come like this every time. Mo, right down there in the bottom of that ditch. That's probably about the wettest strip right there. You can see the grass sticking to his tires. As he goes through there, that's wet right there. Uh-oh. Vaden, what happened? The, it died? TKO. Well, let's check the battery. We threw the white flag. 
It's flashing. What's that mean? Put it on the charger. Put it on the charger. What's the official time here, Dana? Right at 20 minutes. Right at 20 minutes. We dumped the bag twice. And the bag is, it's full again. So we got three bag fulls. Where's and, Derek? And 20 minutes. Oh, yeah, he's still mowing. We're still mowing back here. Let's check how much battery he's got. So he's still got battery going here on the Ego. So let's go ahead and keep mowing, Derek. Preston, you need Preston to step in? So while the Ego is still going, you guys go ahead and tell me about the Ego products. Go ahead, Toby. Go ahead, buddy. You can study it. We've got about three different Ego weed eaters to choose from. Carbon fiber shaft. We have the, um, the we have the string trimmer. It'll, it'll roll the string in. When you go to change the string, it sucks it in by itself. They even have a new product up now. Whenever you hit something that cuts off three inches of your string, it just immediately rolls it out for you. Takes all the guesswork out of it. Grab oh, the it. Line IQ. Yep. Grab it. Mow. Nothing to worry about. Just like this. It's so auto feeding string on a weed eater that self loads and it's battery powered. So, do you even have a reason to throw it anymore? Nope. But, if, the if bad part about the Ego is that poor guy's still mowing and the other guy's on break. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. I think Vaden went to lunch. Oh, there he is. He's still, he's still dumping the bag. Derek's skipping out. He's going to have to skip his lunch hour. So, all the batteries work with all the products. The string trimmer, the mowers. Everything's compatible. Blowers, string fine. trimmers, uh, leaf blowers, leaf blowers, snow blowers, uh, riding lawnmower if you got one. Uh, they do offer a riding lawn, zero turn riding lawnmower. Uh, literally any any tool they make will accept one of their batteries. You can use the riding lawnmower as a charging station, correct? Right. You can, you can charge all your batteries at that riding lawnmower. One ten out, charge six batteries at one time. So you can use the same batteries, two and a half watt, five watt, seven and a half, ten watt batteries. They're all interchangeable. Correct. So I could take the ten watt battery from that lawnmower and put it on my string trimmer. Betcha. I could take the two and a half watt battery from my string trimmer and stick it in that lawnmower. Yep. Won't run very long, but it'll still work. Yep. That ten watt battery is too heavy to put on your string trimmer. That's where the backpack comes in. You put it right on your back and plug her in. <laughs> Uh, pull saws, they got pull saws. Yep. The best pull saws product is, is the chainsaw. The electric power chainsaw is a fan favorite of the phone. Put in the back of your side by side, you're going through the field, you see a branch sticking out with a scratch and everything, nip it off. Easy maintenance. No, no rope starting, no nothing. No mixing gas. Those batteries no will pull sit start. around. Those batteries will sit around and hold a charge forever too. You don't have to constantly have them on the charger. All you need is a little bit of chain oil and you're ready to go. Well, Derek's looking pretty tired over there. Should we let him go to lunch? Pete, jump in. Jump in there and grab it. <laughs> See how fast you can actually mow with it. Yeah, turn that baby up. Derek, turn it up. You turn the speed up. The Ego mower is actually a little faster than the steel mower, but I mean, that's a pretty good pace that he's walking there. But it does get the uh, exercise in there. So snow blowers, zero turn mowers, String trimmers, leaf blowers, hedge trimmers, brooms, power generators, yeah, the, in, the Nexus inverters. Uh, take it'll hold four batteries of any of the sizes. 
um, work in place of a gas generator. You know, power go out or you want to make sure you got some pumps in your house that can't be off. Uh, plug one of those in. It'll it's got a built-in battery tender. It'll keep the batteries charged when it's not being used. And then if you do lose power, uh, three 120 outlets on the front of it, two two USBs, so I have plenty of power if you're without it. We also got lights. Like it runs 10,000 lumens. Also, a hot summer day, like it has been, and we got a fan. It's called a missing fan. You put a bucket of water next to it, run your settings on your speed, throw some mist on you like a day to like today. Derek will probably use that right by now. So. Let's go inside and take a look because I think uh, Derek's going to be out here for a while. So, while Derek's finishing up mowing here, we're going to go inside and uh, check out all the Ego products because. Obviously the Ego battery and mower last longer than the steel. We could be out here for a long time. But we'll go ahead inside and we'll check out the uh, the other steel power or the Ego powered products while the steel mower is sitting out here. Hey, why don't you bring that in? Let's go ahead and charge it up so we can finish this afternoon. While we're walking through the yard, we are a full line Massey Ferguson dealership. You can see all the Massey tractors. Cleaner combine. Got the Bobcat equipment over there. Got skid steers. Excavators. Full lineup of Ferris lawn mowers with suspension on them. Bobcat zero turn mower over there. There's a Ferris. You can see that with the suspension on it. Got a mower trailer. 4,000 bushel bin for when you have a lot of grass clippings. So here's the Ego Zero Turn. We got more of the uh, push mowers there. There's that six port uh, charging station here. Like I said, you can put any size of your batteries in here. Plug into your 110 outlet, charge them all at one time. So zero turn. You get the uh, oh, you gotta have four batteries in it there. You got a full ego setup over here. Different products. Here's the multi-tool, so you can see it's just the power head here, and then you've got a number of options from the hedge trimmer to the edger, a pull saw, and it all attaches just right here on the end. You can see that. So, yeah, a little cultivator, a little tiller, and then the brooms. So Chad can show some of the moving some of the rock out here in the driveway. Take some leaf blower here. Got a turbo switch there if you really want to get some heavy stuff. Puts out some good power. See if you can uh, blow Vaden's hair over there. Look. Oh yeah. He looks pretty hot after out there trying to mess with that steel mower. Had to fight that thing for the last little bit there. Let's see what Chad's got going on out here. There's the uh, inverter right there. That's the, the generator, the battery powered generator. How many people do you think is eating lunch downtown right now going, Mitch Merce is making those poor boys mow that whole lawn with a push mower? <laughs> <laughs> you move snow out of your driveway and you get that rock out in the grass, spring comes, snow's gone, gravel's still there. This is the tool for you. Didn't take it right out of that grass with Derek's still down there mowing. 
Chad's got all the pushing the rocks there out of the grass. So it's actually worked really well for like acorns too. If you got acorns, if you got an oak tree in your yard and it drops all the acorns, you can do this where it'll leave the grass, but push all the acorns to the center and then you can actually just rake them up. All right, you gonna take Derek to lunch with you? You can tell him he can quit now. All right, I think we can declare Derek the winner. Sorry, Vaden. But uh, Derek's out there still mowing, so we're gonna let him go to lunch and uh, appreciate all you guys watching. Uh, these Ego products are pretty good stuff, even though they're battery powered, they're quick and easy to start. Uh, we were probably one of the biggest skeptics on them just because, uh, you know, we're not really battery powered we're not sure if battery really can power onto stuff but we're all sold on this stuff it's pretty good stuff so